What's up guys, welcome back to the channel and today I'm gonna to be teaching you me and Deja's routine to Meg the Stallion thought-ish, clean version today. But it's been a while since I did a tutorial here, but great news, the studios in LA are finally reopening, which means I can go back to choreographing and teaching class. As you know, we also have the DNCR Academy where we do monthly challenges, extra special guest instructors, and we have a huge announcement that we've now gamified DNCR. So you can even track your progress, share videos with other people, post them straight to social media. It's really, really dope. So go check it out, dncr.com. So let's get started. Now for this one, you need a lot of energy. It's not too intricate, not too clean. It's mostly about just dancing really full out. So first thing you're gonna do is start with your right knee going in. You're gonna go one, two, then you're gonna go cross on cross and you're gonna roll up and hit your shoulder. So the timing here is six, seven, eight. You go one, two, and three, four. Then from here, you're gonna step to the right. You're gonna go five, six. So your knees are just coming in. Then you're gonna pull that left leg in twice. You're gonna go seven, eight. So my left hand is out here just for sort of the style of it. That right hand pulls your foot. Then you're gonna step behind. You're gonna go left, right, left. You're gonna shift your heels, boom. And then you're gonna go cross and up down it's almost like you're lifting your head so you want your chin to go with that so add that on from the top you go six seven eight and one two and three hit four go five six pull seven eight go one and two heels cross and up down hey so that might have been a little fast i know you could go back and do it a couple times the biggest thing to remember on this first part like i said is energy so you want to make sure that you really put your whole body into these groups this is one Two, you're going, and three, four, you're hitting five, six, this is a seven, eight, then you step behind, one, and two, heels, cross, and up, down. From here, you're just gonna pull through, five, you're gonna stop on six, kinda contract here, so you're gonna go heel, heel, boom, and then you're gonna knock, and you're gonna bounce this over for six counts. So, this part is all about your attitude and performance, what you want to make sure of when you come here is that you stop clean here. You're going to hear the beat go chiggy, chiggy. So that's what we're hitting here. I'm knocking my heel and my chin goes with it over to the right. Then my left heel, click. Then I'm hitting boom. And this is just a freestyle. Once you get here, if you're dancing this with a partner, you can kind of interact with them, whatever you want. Three, four, five, six. Then you're going to go back, back. She says whole lot of venom. So all I'm doing here is my right hand and my right leg are kind of connected. You're just circling back. Then you're gonna kick this foot out, boom. You're gonna drop down and you're gonna jump and bring your hands to your chest a little more and then we're gonna go back slow. You're gonna go right, left, right, throw it around. Then you're gonna use this arm again to pull as you step on your left foot. You're going punch and then when you punch with your left, you're bringing your hand to your face. And this is actually like, I'm grab, I didn't want to cover my mouth because you won't be able to hear me, but I'm covering my mouth right here, yeah? So let's get that part one more time. Here you did a whole lot of venom. You went push and chest. You're going deep, deep, throw. You pull this through. Then you're going punch, mouth, pull. I think she says dinner. I'm probably wrong, but it sounds to me like whole lot of dinner. So that's what I'm saying. Dinner, and then you're gonna pull this again, and that's gonna send you into this little groove. So this is one more time. After here, you go punch and ha, then you do it again, shoom. Step, step, you're gonna say nah, nah. And then you're gonna do two grooves here. You're gonna go up, up. So as my knee goes in, I'm pulling up with that elbow. Up, uh, so it says up, up. And then it's gonna go boom, boom, boom. That's your rhythm. So boom, you're wiggling up. I'm going in and in and in. Boom. Then I'm hitting down, boom. And then you're gonna push your right hip back and around. And if you watch the video on this, you'll see how Deja and I do it slightly different. She does it a lot better. Uh, but you could follow either of us. So I kind of like did this little thing where I controlled her type of deal, and she just went lower and really pushed back. The timing is what's important. Boom, boom, boom. Three, four. Then you're gonna jump out. You're gonna go five and pull to your hip. Five and. You're gonna go six and shoulder, shoulder. Seven, you throw it across your body to go listen. She says, let me hear. 
and then you're gonna step out and throw this across. Good. So that's where we're gonna stop for a second because there's just a couple eight counts left for the chorus. Let's go from the top. Really important when you get to this last part. After boom, boom, three, four, this is fast. It goes five and six and seven and eight, one. She says, chick knew better than to let me hear. Da, 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 da. So you wanna make sure you get that part really clean. That's really important. All right, from the top, add it on up to there. Five, six, seven, eight, jump. One, two, and three, shoulder. Five, six, pull, seven, eight, left, right, left, heels cross and up, down, one, six, da, da, boom. Two, three, four, you have a long time here. Seven, eight, you go one, two, Three, D, D, da, gi, whoop, whoop, head, boom, chill, A, take it back, back, pull, pull, brrr, boom, boom, three, four, this goes chick, knew better than to let me hit, cross, nice, so, hopefully you get up to there, we're going to add on just this last part and then we'll go through it a couple times, this part's really easy, you're just going cross and knees, she says hands on my knees, Ha. You're going to do another pull. You're going to go pull and that knee's coming in. Pull and then you're going to hit and bring this leg up. And you can kind of whop, turn that hip too. So boom and whop. Then I'm going to give you a little TikTok moment here in a second. You're going to go open, close. You're going to go pull, smack, roll. So let's just get the arms. Arms are open, cross, A, A, roll. Yeah. So the first two. It's kind of a left, right, left, right. You're just doing this groove here. And then we step, then we rock, then we rock. So let me hear hands on my knees and a boom and a whop. Hands on my knees and a whoop and a whoop and a roll. Last move, you're just going hands on my knees, hands on my knees and boom. Or Deja went. Hands on my knees, hands on my knees, and boom. So any version of that that you want, make sure this is really big and extend your arms, and then really drop your level, and then you're going, and seven, and eight, and boom, that last one. And that's it, that's the whole combo. Now, obviously, when we taught this, it was like an hour, so we don't expect you to have learned it in five minutes here. So we're gonna go back through it slowly. Remember, you can always rewind. What's important is that you get the details the timing, you understand where everything goes so that when you try it with the music, even if you don't get it perfect, you can start to mark it and work it up to speed. Yeah, so let's go slow from the top and then we'll go a little bit faster. Five, six, seven, eight, you go, hey, two and three, bop, you go, five, six, seven, eight, you go, one and two, heels cross and up and five, six, da, da, here we go, two, three, Four, chill, five, six, eight, seven, venom, one, two, three, D, D, whoom, six, seven, and wha, one, two, three, chill, four, five, pull up, pull up, brrr, boom, boom, two, A, and this is five, and six, and seven, and hey, hands on my knees, and a whoop, and a ga, hands on my knees, and an A, and A, and A, and hands, bop, and hands, bop, and boom. Nice. Now, if you've never done this groove before, you want to make sure that you put all that weight on your left foot. You don't want to go like this and just be like shaking. You want to go down, down, down. This rock is what's going to give it that groove, right? And then all I'm doing is shaking my hips left, 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 left. So it's left, A, A. And hands on my knees, and hands on my knees, eh? Most importantly with this whole routine, it should be fun. If it's not fun, if you're stressing yourself out, take a deep breath. And let's go from the top. Let's go full speed, we're gonna try it. Here we go. Five, six, five, six, seven, you go. One and two and three, four, five, six, and eight, ha. One and two and cross and up, down, boom. Six, da da, da da, boom, two, Three, four, five, six, eight, eight, one, two, three, four, and five, six, 
D, D, Wha, boom, two, three, A, A, pull, pull, brrr, boom, boom, and one, and two, and two, and wha, hands on my knees, and a hit, and a hop, and a hit, and a chill, and a pull, and a roll, and hands on my knees, and hands on my knees, and boom, A, A, freestyle. That's the whole combo. You guys made it. Amazing job. Again, if you didn't get through it all, you don't remember it all, you shouldn't. This is not a 10 minute challenge. You're not supposed to learn it in 10 minutes. If you did, you're amazing. You should become a professional dancer and teach me how to dance. But if not, just go back over the steps. Remember, have fun with this combo. This is like the first piece like this I've been able to do in a long time. It was just full out fun. The energy in class was absolutely crazy. I'm gonna be teaching a lot more, hopefully in LA, hopefully coming on tour and dancing with you guys. So once you learn this, make sure you tag me and tag Deja in your videos when you post them so we can see all of your covers. If you wanna learn more stuff, go to dncr.com and I'll see you back here in the studio. Well, this is the home studio, but I either see you here at this home studio or in the other studio now that it's reopened finally real soon. Love you guys.